this Friday morning, I've I've had a reasonably successful week at work, and um, this Friday morning I'm relaxing and maybe celebrating a little bit. You can see that things are in a little bit of disarray back there. Well, Cindy and I are breaking up. She's moving out. And the way I can enjoy that, I said, well, no, it's hard. No, it's really fucking hard. But I'm going to have some, uh, some Lefroig 10. Lefroig 10 has been my go-to single malt for many years now. Especially when it comes to peated Isla malts. And uh, I like this stuff because it's just no compromises. Just give me the smoke, give me the peat. Oh, good pup on that one. Oh, yeah. You know, I'm not smelling much. Maybe my sniffer's out of whack. Now here it comes. Here it comes. Gotta coat that glass. Lose a bit to the floor. Road tar. Road tar smoke. And more road tar. Oh yeah. For road tar, it's really smooth. It's got that medicinal quality to it. Why? It's got that medicinal quality to it. It's almost like there's a honey note to it compared to the Kalila that I was drinking earlier. Mm. Yeah, you know, this is very nice. I've also been watching the movie Vanishing Point, and I'm going to get into some more of those. Uh, early 70s hot rod kind of movies watching those just to uh, relive my youth a little bit I remember that one uh, from I think I haven't watched it in 40 years and I'm watching it this morning there's gonna be a few others you know like White Line Fever and a couple other movies like that from the early 70s and high-powered cars and things like that Mmm, Freug. Yeah, Freug. I've, I've liked Freug since the first time I tried it. It's peat, it's smoke, it's some brine, some dirty socks in there. Fabulous stuff. Um, yeah, I highly recommend this. Cheers, Slanjovar. Food quick. Uh, food quick. Food quick. Food quick. Food quick. Food quick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>